In this video, we are going to fetch the banners to our uh, JSON file. Now, let's create a function to get these banners that we have created in the previous video. I will go and copy this code and paste it, it above it. Now, the post data, I will change it, it to banners, banner data. And I will remove this called banner. And let me go down. Let me check banners. And here, let me remove this. And let me remove, uh, add the data post data variable equal new or sorry data array equal array okay so variable dump and let me check for the banner data banner data and banner data so and uh, banner dump okay passing the banner variable let me remove it for now and let me create uh, for each loop banner data and remove here and let me post as post variable okay so we are getting all posts and we are going to include the banners inside the news array you remember the news array that we have we need to put it uh, underneath the news and inside a new array called uh, called uh, uh, banners and we are going to pass or to get the post id or the banner id a post data or post variable ID the inside we will put the title of the banner post variable and we put post title and inside variable called description okay Till now, we are getting the ID, the title, and the description for the banner. Get field <coughs> description. Okay. And we, we are getting the post variable. Inside, also, we, we are getting, uh, let me check for the image URL or the link. Okay. So we will get the link, panel link called, okay. <clears throat> if we go to the, the post banners, edit, and we will need to get the banner, okay, the banner image. Remember, you need to put them correctly. The link and get the field and we need to pass it as on our custom field that we have created. Banner link, click link <clears throat> and we pass the post, okay? Image equal the get field and we are getting the banner underscore image remember as i told you it is very case sensitive so we are getting the uh, custom fields that we have created so we need to get them exactly the same name the same uh, the way of uh, writing them banner underscore click underscore link 
and banner underscore image these are very important and also the description getting the fields so we are using the get field uh, uh, function in order to get the custom field that we have created now inside variable we are uh, passing also the image and if there is no image it will be passed as empty string okay so till now we have getting the the custom fields for our banner images a banner uh, in the correct way okay so we are putting them into our data array and we will return them as a response or put them into the response called under a banners so guys uh, look at this banners this is uh, the, the, the way or the response that we will get all the banners under a banners array. So let me go and we have an error at 814. So we are getting the response. I need to put it at a variable. Okay, let's and here we go, guys. We, un, we have got them under the banners a title so we till now we have a banners and a, a news um, uh, titles so let me check and here we go the news and we have banners so banners and the news because we, the response contains the uh, the banners and the news titles okay we have four banners and the three uh, three posts and the news okay till now our uh, api is working perfectly and uh, we are making a professional api that we it's passing the banners and passing parsing the uh, news so next videos we are going to implement the advertisements and we'll see how to put them into android studio thank you guys uh, see you next uh, videos